Yo guys, what's up? Monday 6 here. We're back on part 3 of the Manco 606 with the Briggs & Stratton V-Twin 16 horsepower build. Because as I said previously, there's a, a bolt that snapped off in the uh, crankcase cover. But uh, now we're just going to start assembling stuff. We have a gas tank to put on. We're going to mount it right up here where the headrests are. And uh, hopefully we'll get this thing running today. Alright, let's get ready to put our chain on. Since everything's locked in, you can install the bolt. It goes right into the crankshaft. I got everything hooked up. I have the torque converter, the belt, the chain, sprocket tightened up. Now all we have to do is mount the fuel tank up there, run some fuel line, maybe a fuel filter, and uh, this thing should be moving. Okay, I got the gas tank here. I went ahead and bolted on some right angle brackets. And I'm going to be mounting it right here. And we're going to match drill and we're going to through bolt. And then we're going to run some fuel line and a fuel filter. All right, we got the gas tank installed here. It's on there. Pretty damn good. We're going to put the pet cock on it and we're going to start running some fuel line and a fuel filter down there to the fuel pump. Okay, have the pet cock hooked up. Have my fuel line run into a fuel filter here and then run into the fuel pump. Okay, here she is, all done. Briggs and Stratton V Twin inside the Manco 606. Direct bolt on, direct bolt on motor mount, direct bolt on motor. Now I have to slot the motor mount because I have to adjust the chain a little bit, it is uh, pretty loose. Um, but other than that, she's running pretty good, sounds pretty good, fits in there, here's the uh, 606, the V-Twin Briggs & Stratton 16 horsepower. Forty series torque converter. Okay, I'm going to do a couple drive-bys here. I can't really romp on it because I'm afraid I, uh, the chain will kind of fall off on me. Like I said, I still have to slot the uh, motor, motor mount holes for the uh, motor so I can push the engine up a little bit so I can tighten the chain. Um, other than that, I think that's just a minor setback. Somewhat ultimate fun and at this Scorpion's uh, potential. 
All right, let me set this thing down and uh, get a couple passes. Take it for a little ride. It's just a chat, it's just a chain slapping, don't worry. Oh man! Oh, I gotta get better brakes on this thing. Here we go. Hold on. Hold on. May have ran out of fuel, not sure. But that was awesome! I just wanted to thank everybody for being so patient with this build. Like I said, there'll be more videos to come once I'm uh, able to move the motor a little bit and tighten that chain. And I hope you guys enjoy this video and I hope it inspires everybody to uh, you know, mod their go-kart and make it a little faster and be unique. Alright you guys, hope you enjoy. Stay tuned for more. Monday to 6, out.